Hey there, it's me Red Knight and welcome back to my channel for a Food Street video. Now as most of you know I've been playing the game since it first came out and I've enjoyed playing it and I still do. I live stream almost every Saturday. Now this Saturday because it's New Year and I'm spending time with my family as we enjoy our holiday, I didn't do a stream. But I was able to collect all of the wonderful decoration over the Christmas period and that gorgeous 2021 decoration for the end of the year and the beginning of the new year which we're now in to go with my collection and I've used that as my base design theme area as you can see 16, 17, 18, 19, 20 and 21 now I'm looking forward to continuing through this year so hopefully you can join me on Saturdays because I do as a master chef within the game give away some nice goodies as well for example if you would love to win a beautiful pet well we do those in my stream same with the interactive decoration we also give away the gems and the coins and those beautiful voucher packs as well but pushing that to the side let's show you my current design now, I am always and I really really do like the actual ice theme that comes within the game I think winter itself has a very nice aspect to it and I've used that ice theme as the basic foundation for my current restaurant layout now today, since it is the brand new year, and I've been thinking about this seriously, like how should I use my coinage? At the moment, I've got uh, 23 uh, sorry, 234,102. Now, I do like to actually spend the coinage to buy decoration. And there's a lot of wonderful decoration down there that I do have within my collection. Uh, there's more coming uh, as we progress from each theme into the next theme. And sometimes I can buy it, sometimes not. My biggest uh, hurdle within the game is often the vouchers. There are things I'd love to buy, but I just don't have enough vouchers. And that comes down to playing. So the more you play, the more vouchers as you actually get. Well, in addition to actually getting the decoration, you've also got to purchase the stoves. Now, I've got all of the stoves up to and including these three. Now, because of my level, it says I can buy the tapas bar, the dim sum trolley, and the barbecue baker. But you can see down there, price-wise, there's a lot of coinage. So you build up your coins, then you spend it, you build up your coins, and you spend it, and all of a sudden, you've got, like, no money again. And they just kind of, like, get put back and back and back as you level up. Well, I've decided to do something today. I'm going to be spending some of my money, and I'm actually going to be purchasing a machine. And then later, because I think it's about time, I will actually cover some of these machines for you and make a separate video talking about machines and what they do. Because a few people have been asking me questions as they picked up the game and think, oh, I like the look of this. Tell me more. Now, sure, no problems. I've already done loads in the past anyway, as we tend to do more live streams and videos. But why not? So for 2021, uh, I'm going to try to include some more gameplay videos, uh, probably without voice, maybe with voice, depending on the situation, in addition to my live streams. So we've got the Tapas Bar for 210000 Oh, there's the dim sum trolley for 220,000. Now, the barbecue smoker, which I do like the look of, I can't get yet. And I've got this gorgeous little space down there. Now, the other thing I want to do within my game is to actually open up these areas. I've done the one corner, and I've got the whole of this back section to do as well. Now, it becomes more expensive as you start expanding towards these areas, as you can see from the actual coinage that uh, is required. In addition to the coinage, you need a lot of these deeds and mark stakes. So so the question is, should I do it? Now, at the moment within the game, there is this wonderful event where this airplane comes and lands down, and then she gives you a little shop where you can purchase items. And there are good things down there, like uh, this gorgeous uh, deed down there, which is for 30 and 50. I can buy that one. That then goes into my storage. I slide along again, and oh, look, there's some nice little planks down there. I could do that one too, so we could take that. Or there's another deed there as well, which is 20 and 50. I could take that one, but no, I don't have any left. Oh my god, I need to get some more pieces. There's a nice little stake down there for 30. I could take that one as well. And these pieces would allow me to actually level up within the game, which is wonderful. It really, really is. Now, the decoration does look nice this time. I'm so tempted, but I want to start actually working on the outside of my actual restaurant this time. So now I've purchased another one of those and those. I've still got two more to go or another one, four of those. I could spend the actual diamonds that I've got within the game, so the gems to open up if I wanted to, but like I said, the main thing for today is buying that machine so it's Christmas time. 
So tapas bar or dim sum trolley. Well, tapas bar is the one I haven't got. That's a little bit lower down. So I'm going to place that one down there. It's very, very pretty indeed. And it does look good. And I like it with the actual lights around the outside. You've also got that gorgeous dim sum, which is again very, very gorgeous indeed. And that looks wonderful as you slide that around. And then there's that beautiful barbecue smoker. Oh, it's so tempting, isn't it? Which one to get? Well, it's the tapas bar today. So we're going to place that one down. Let's turn it around. And we click on that one. And that is now done. My coinage has gone down. I'm a very happy person indeed. Ooh, pizza. It's ready. Let's go do it. There we go. One more pizza and I am done. Done. I can't wait. Got seven hours to go. I got my bacon on the go down there as well. I just need one more bacon piece, and that is done. Now, speaking of done, one day, five hours and fifty-nine minutes, or I can spend twenty-one gems to speed it up. Do you know what? I'm going to spend the gems because I want to see what it looks like, and so do you. So we tap that again, and it's Christmas time. Actually, Christmas is over. But it is my first New Year present. Look at that, everybody. Gorgeous. Oh, my God. A brand new machine. Now, because it is brand new, there are going to be some products I can do. And as I level up, it will give me more products. So let's find out what I'm going to get. And can I start making anything? Well, the first three products I've got down there is this gorgeous beautiful yummy delicious recipe now as you start to level it up you'll be able to work on the mastery as you can see down there and that's the same with any of those dishes now i get a lot of requests for these so this one here is the seafood paella i get a lot of the calamari and i also get a lot of the spanish omelet and oh no there's more to come later from level 66 so when i get to my next level there's even more so Interesting, interesting, interesting. Now, the potatoes take quite some time to grow, as do the onions. Cream is a bit of a long time one as well. And a lot of seafood down here as well. So do I have any prawns left? Well, I've been using my prawns for the pizzas and other bits that I've been doing. But I don't think I've got any down there. Oh, I got some pizzas. Let's have a look. Can I do any more prawns? No. So we go get some prawns on the go down there, which means this one down there as well. And we take some more of those to get some more of the seaweed rake, which seaweeds can give me more of the prawn net. And I can't do any prawns just yet, so we'll hold off on that one. Okay, but if we come back to my machine, let's have a look. Nope, still need the prawns. Can we, can we do some? We do some eggs. Yeah, we can do eggs. Eggs is good. I got plenty of these ones for eggs. I could do some of these for the cream as well, which would be very nice indeed. Take the cheese, and there we go. Get that little on the go for the cream for later. Then I can get that one started because I've got four of those squids now. Yay. Mm -hmm. But we're about to do my first Spanish omelette. Oh my God, there we go. Look at that. Oh, that looks good. 34 minutes, everybody. Which means I need potatoes. So, three hours and 30 minutes to grow those potatoes. Ooh, that's going to be fun. And I need onions as well, which are going to take a bit of time. But first things first, my carrots. Right, everybody, I'm happy. I've got a new machine. The new year has started. I've got one more pizza to do for my boat to get some nice vouchers. I will see you next Saturday uh, after I come back from my holidays. So have a wonderful new year. Fingers crossed 2021 will be better than the last one. Take care, have fun, and download Food Street. Links are down below in the video description, as is the ability to click subscribe to my channel and hit the bell notification. But bye now.